Greetings. I am Sterling. You are about to- oh, I can't take it! I can't take it! I, I'm sorry, folks. I, I'm sorry. Once again, I'm trying very hard to stay in character, but it's very difficult. Um, don't worry. It's not the folks at the other studio mowing their lawn this time. It's that pounding feeling that I feel every single week when I record this show. I can't concentrate because it's always there. I mean, sometimes it goes away. It just... Well, it went away, but I know that it'll always come back. It feels like it's controlling me. It makes me feel like I have no control over myself. Look, folks, not only do I, Sterling, write the episodes of The Headlight Zone, I also write them. And unfortunately, this week, I've been so bothered by this constant pounding feeling that I couldn't even focus on writing a good season finale. I don't have a story for today. Uh, maybe I can come up with one on the spot. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Uh, there once was a car named Merling, and Merling had this constant pounding feeling at all times, and he didn't know what was going on, and it was so frustrating, and he's felt this way whenever he's tried to film the show that he creates, but he always tries to not bring it up, but, but sometimes he's just got to bring it up. He brought it up in last year's season finale of his show, but, but he didn't know what happened afterwards. He just kind of blacked out after. Yeah, he doesn't remember what happened after that finale when he addressed that pounding feeling, so now he's just really confused, and it's kind of scary, man. That's the end of our story. No twist. You know why? Because, because I don't know what's going on, so I can't write the ending of his story until I know what's going on with me. I need to figure it out. <sighs> Look, I'm sorry, folks, okay? I've just been so aggravated with this pounding feeling around me at almost all times. Look, I, I promise I'll come up with a better season finale next year, okay? But until then, I've been Sterling. This has been the Headlight Zone. And that is a wrap. Okay. All right, got to get to editing this. Get Sterling out of here. Not going to use him for like a year anyway. <sighs> The funny thing with the headlight zone is the fact that every week you're asked to suspend your disbelief, to believe the unbelievable, accept the impossible, the strange, the supernatural, because it all takes place in this strange world known as the headlight zone. But the funny thing is, if you're watching this show, you've been suspending your disbelief the whole time. This is no host. All this is is a toy car who we, through imagining and suspending our disbelief, have given life to. As he moves around and talks and acts and tells jokes and tells stories, you've been suspending your disbelief the whole time to believe that this car is a character and not just some toy that I bought at Target three years ago. This has been The Headlight Zone. Oh, and happy Halloween.